we're going to make a chicken tikka rogan josh so as usual start off with some ghee very simple curry this one it's very similar to a puna slightly hotter and it has a curry tomatoey topping so to the ghee we add some probably see I'm always wiping the side of the uh, pan. If you don't do that, the spice that stick to the side of the pan is going to burn and it'll create a burnt taste in the curry so that's why I keep wiping the pan. It becomes a habit as well after a while. Okay, 
So to the sauce that's left in the pan, I'm going to add quite a few tomatoes. And a little bit more fenugreek. And some chopped um, red peppers or pimentos. And to that I'm going to add just a little bit of water. Now this part I'm doing is probably different to other chefs that do it. Uh, they'll probably add a bit more curry sauce but I don't want it becoming too thick. Um, just to preserve the tomato flavour I just add a bit of water so you know the tomato gets a chance to cook and uh, the sauce doesn't become too thick. Why not add the tomato into the whole curry? Why, why do it? in this two part way. Because Rogan Josh, Josh means a topping. That's why we did the, put the um, tomatoes separate. Because if you cook the uh, tomatoes in the curry itself, it becomes all soggy and it, it mixes in into the uh, sauce itself. And you can't see any tomatoes. And the flavors sort of uh, blended in with all the rest of the curry. So if you cook it like that, separate, you preserve the tomato flavour, plus you put it on top of the curry and it looks nice as well. And that's what a josh is. <laughs> It'll taste similar to a boona if you add it, add it to the curry. <laughs> So what's Rogan mean then? Well, Rogan means the tomato. Rogan also. Josh means sauce. And Rogan is the tomato top. So Rogan sauce, Rogan Josh is the tomato topping. Okay, so the tomatoes have softened. It's up to every individual how soft you want the tomatoes to be. You can leave them crunchy if you like. Just add them to the sauce and just cook it a little bit. Preserve the crunchiness or you can make it nice and soft. Everybody has their own preference. But we sort of like do it in the middle. So to that I'll just add some coriander. Oh, sorry. And a little bit of spiced oil. And that's it, that's the topping ready. And just put that on top of the chicken. And it is.